morning, good afternoon, good evening, and good night, internet. But don't go to sleep, because we haven't even got to the game yet. This is The Binding of Isaac, a fantastic game where you play as a child named Isaac who is trying to escape his mother through the many levels underneath his basement because the voice of God has told her to kill you. I am Jake McKee, and this is Let's Play with a Tweak. So let's see if you can guess it. I'll give you five seconds. Ding, time's up. That's right, I had five grams of coke to a can of bean and bottle all over my computer. Fucking deal, because we got a sex pack of Red Bull and a processor that can drink. In the game, you move from dungeon to dungeon, defeating foes, gaining money, health, buffs, or debuffs. The rooms are procedurally generated, which means the levels are produced algorithmically opposed to manually. Basically, the game generates each level on the fly. And oh god, I am tired already. I cannot do this for ten minutes. Wow. Um, hi, Internet. How are you? I don't even know where I got this. Uh, I'm probably a cross between those uh, late night salesmen you see on TV, and uh, Robin Williams from Good Morning Vietnam. Can you imagine that? Good morning Vietnam! I am here to sell you mattresses, mattresses by the dozen. I can't believe how cheap these are. These are flying out the door. Yeah, no, I can't do that for long either. Oh my god, this is tiring. All right, well, let's actually, maybe let's have a look at the game. Okay, so what I just got there, that was a treasure room, and I got a power up in it. And you can see that my uh, it's augmented my shot. My uh, my slug now shoots in multiple directions. Yay, multi-tier. Uh, that is a soul heart. Okay, so soul heart just ups your life by one heart, but you can't regain it with red hearts. So it's kind of like one-time life. All right, here we go. Boss fight. Oh god. Yeah, this. Um, yeah, so he shoots spiders. That's fantastic. Or she shoots spiders. It could be a she. A very very ugly she. I'm not sure. Uh, well, if, if she's very pretty. Her name's Widow. Okay, so something amazing about this game, guys, is you can play it for hours and hours and hours. Uh, like those... It's got the feel of those those wonderful old arcade games. Uh, you know, you play Street Fighter an obsessively long amount of time. Uh, it Kind of like the, along those lines, you, you play it forever, but the, you... Uh, I don't know. You'll never run out of new stuff to find. Since they all kind of just, you know, mishmash stuff together. Diablo! Diablo, that's a great example. It's just like Diablo, except much smaller. You know, uh, you, you're dungeon crawling and you're picking up items and powering up. And, um, and you, you're just going to keep finding new combinations. And all of a sudden, once you're like, oh yeah, I've seen everything, you know, nothing's really new has popped out in a while. Bam! New boss. Completely new boss that, you know, it rips your asshole open and... And, uh, and then stomps on it. It's, yeah, it doesn't matter. You, you can have fantastic power-ups and you go, I am God, I am invincible. The game cannot win. And then it shows you that it can win by, you know, sending something like a, a tiny atomic fly to you that when it touches you, you turn into something that shoots itself. That doesn't matter. I don't think so. Hey guys, as you can probably tell, this is actually a post-production com uh, commentary. I, I decided to go because I sped up the video and while the music sounds great, I'm sure my voice at that speed uh, just would not work. And uh, I don't think I could naturally do that either. Although maybe I'll try both, that could be fun. Yeah, why not? That'd be horrible, it'd be like a, a whole video of tongue ties. Peter Pan, Peter Pan, Peter Pan, Peter Pan, Peter Pan, Done with that very quickly. Okay, um... Yeah, so I'm still pretty new to the whole YouTube production thing that's trying to find my style. So I'm also doing a Far Cry Let's Play at the moment, which should be fun, and I think I'll do in-game commentary on that. So, you know, starting the actions and the horror and the comedy hopefully all come naturally. You guys tell me what works. Do you want If you like it? Like it. And if you don't like it, tell me, because then I'll change it. And if you really don't like it, then, you know, banish me from YouTube. Don't do that. Please. I'm not very good about talking about this game, am I? Uh, just kind of letting it go in the background. It's alright. It's, uh... It's good. It was fun to play. Very, very good game. Uh, very, very hard. I... It's died a surprisingly large amount of times. I think I've, I've played this for about 20 hours and I've died like 142 times. I don't know what the math is there. Yeah, I'm not even gonna try to work out. Yeah, but yeah, uh, you die like in the first five seconds when you start playing. Yeah, it goes something like dead, 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 
Oh, yeah. No, dead. 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 Yeah, this is my fault. Dead. 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 No, wait. Oh. Oh, wait. wait. He's got it. Hey, come on. Nearly. Dead. You guys should stop hoping. It's all dead. Everyone's a dead clean. We're all dying, see? Dead. Yay, come on. Maybe our unicorn power. Woo! And... Oh, I'm going right. Oh, no, dead. 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 You know, you die, 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 die. And uh, then you progress, and you, you learn some of the some of the enemies. But uh, you can't learn these each of these individual dungeons. As I said before, at uh, I said at 100 miles an hour, though, these dungeons are procedurally generated. So they're all pre-designed, but uh, they they work on an algorithm that kind of matches different bits up. And uh, so you know you can't learn a whole level. You can learn an individual dungeon, even though it might tweak itself, or you make it the same rock pattern with uh, different enemies in it. Or you might luckily, you know, land the same rock pattern with two flies in the entire room. But uh, across the entire level, you don't know what's going to come up against. But as it says, it's based on algorithm. It's not going to be something completely impossible. You can, uh, you can generally work through it. Okay guys, I haven't got much left to say now, besides um, it's a fantastic game, you can buy it for $5 in Steam and another $2 for the uh, the DLC, which is The Wrath of the Lamb, which was what we've been playing today, and lots of horrible, horrible extra things that try and kill you in it, but you know, cool perks too, so give it a go, give it a go, complete transfer the game, and just because I'm sure this is what you wanted, the rest of the run, 1000% speed, enjoy!